depression, anxiety, you're not alone. Many are feeling the same way you're feeling right now. Many of us have been through it, and I'm going to tell you a couple of things that you can do to get out of it. I don't want you to stay in that slump. My name is Reed, and you've reached my channel, Reliving Free. And the first thing I want you to do is acknowledge that you're feeling what you're feeling. Don't dismiss it. Uh, these feelings can go on for weeks. And if you don't acknowledge, it can go on for months and even years. Um, you need to know that you matter and your feelings matter. Don't dismiss it. Don't let anyone else dismiss it. Be true to yourself. Acknowledge those feelings. Now, if you feel like you want to hurt yourself, you have any immediate plans to want to hurt yourself, I want you to get on the National Suicide Lifeline. Call them now. I'm going to put the telephone number on my screen. Uh, don't play around with it. Either call 911 or call the National Suicide Lifeline if you want to hurt yourself or you have a plan to hurt yourself. As those feelings are immediate, and I don't want you to rob yourself of living this life. You deserve to live a life, and you deserve, deserve to live your best life. Talk to someone. Um, one of the best things that you can do is talk to someone. If it's a family member, a loved one, a trusted person, um, talk to them and let them know how you're feeling. Um, that goes along the line with not dismissing. You don't want to dismiss these feelings. You want to talk about it. Um, if you're working or in school or you're a member of some group or something, uh, organization that requires you to be there um, on a regular basis, take some time off. Uh, even if it's one day, a couple of days, a weekend, take some time off. Uh, give yourself uh, what we call a mental health break. Uh, sometimes just taking a little bit of time off for yourself to acknowledge your feelings, to acknowledge you, to make yourself know that you matter will do a world of difference. Um, also exercise, get moving, um, get moving. Um, that movement helps to get those chemicals um, stimulated and getting um, moved out of our you know, brain in order to our system to lift our moods. Guys, uh, go places, uh, go do things, even if you don't feel like it. Push yourself to do it. Um, this is the part where you're going to have to get motivated and pull up your bootstraps and just push yourself to do it. Um, because believe me, at the end of it, you're going to feel better. Your mood is going to be lifted. Get some sunlight. Get that vitamin D3. You need that D3. You need that sunlight. You need the air. You need to go outside and, and, and get out from being inside of the house. Get off of that couch. Put the remote control down. Get outside. You have to go to the backyard, go to your front yard, and just get under the open sky. Sometimes that feeling of being closed in can make you weigh you down. Um, getting outside, looking up into the sky, enjoying the sunlight, enjoying the air. These are things that have been given to us naturally. And these are natural stimulus or stimuli that will allow you to raise or increase your mood. Um, very, very important. Uh, music, um, it's always good for me. And sometimes when I'm feeling low, feeling down, uh, turn on some music, some good, happy music. Not the depressing kind. Don't turn on the oldies and start going back to the back in the day and feeling sad and crying about your uh, last boyfriend or your ex back in the day. You used to love him, your ex-girl, and she used to love her. And then you're going back into that same mode of depression. No, get that happy music going. Maybe you put on some music to dance. Get around and just move and dance and do your thing. Do the salsa. Get up and do the groove. Do whatever it is that makes you get up and move and get out of that slump. It'll help you, I promise you. Even if you don't feel like doing it, put yourself to doing it. Also, uh, what helps is journaling. Um, what I found helped me was every day uh, writing down in a journal what I was grateful for. Um, that was something that I had to push myself to do because I wanted to focus in on all the things that was going wrong and all of that. But it made me focus in on those things that are going good and not bad. Trust me, there are good things going on in your life. You just have to acknowledge it. If you don't pick yourself up out of this mood, uh, who's going to do it? No one can do it for you, but you can do it. You have what it takes inside of you to do it. And you want to be able to show up in this world. Why? Because this world needs you. We're here to serve. 
We're here to be here for one another. If it's for your family and your immediate loved ones, you're here to be there for them. And when you don't show up for them, they're missing out and they're missing out on you. And um, you don't want to rob them of that. You don't want to rob yourself of the joy of fellowshipping with those people who love you and who care about you. If you feel like you're alone and you don't have anyone, join a community group. Join a social local group. There are people out there that you can go and network with that will be there for you, that will help you. You can befriend folk and forge relationships. But you're going to have to take some work um, and it's worth it. Uh, don't rob yourself of the privilege of receiving our God-given right, which is to have happiness. The work that you do to get there, trust me, it's going to be well worth it. Don't let those voices rob you into thinking that this is a permanent situation and that you have to end it now. Don't give up. I'm here to tell you, you're going to make it. You're going to do it. Why? Because you deserve it. And the world deserves you to show up. Take care of yourself. If I set something of value to you, uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. If you feel like this is a community where you can join, um, we provide lifestyle advice. Um, I have my email address below down in the description if you want to uh, hit me up and talk to me about anything. Um, I'm here to give life advice. I am a psychiatric RN. I have a lot of experience in life, and I'm here to talk about anything that you want, personal, emotional, career development. I have some great um, tools for you there, um, mental health issues, or anything you need, uh, just let me know. Comment down below. Tell me what you think. If I provided any value to you, um, you can also subscribe and tell others to come and join this channel. Thank you for joining in to Reliving Free. And I want you to live your best life. I'm living my best life. Why? Because I'm living free. And I want you to live free too.